Hey guys, it's been a minute since we've talked on the channel and basically this is just gonna be a quick update to be honest. It's not really like anything super special. Oh wow, can you even hear me? Oh yeah, okay, you can hear me, thank God. So basically the next week I'm going to be on vacation, um, but I've already pre-filmed a bit of Spider-Man to kind of periodically trinkle into that week as well as I'll probably do a couple of vlog videos that you guys will be able to watch because I don't wanna leave the channel completely dead for the week that I am gone, but I need this vacation, guys. I really need it. It is just a personal vacation where I won't have to do any other work. I won't have to, I don't know, no one will expect anything of me, but I do want to be able to show you some of the sites. So in the vlogs, I'm going to absolutely do that as well. Um, but as you all know, over the past, I mean, pretty much since January, my personal life has been so stressful. I, I made a video a while back talking about it and just kind of saying that I've been going through a lot, um, but I didn't really inform you on what I was going through at the time. And I think that it's about time I just go ahead and say it. Um, and I think, I think in a way, at that moment, I wasn't ready to announce to everybody that I was going through all of this stuff. I wanted to make sure that I was okay with it, that I was healed for the most part. And um, yeah, you know, like you, you just, you just want to get past something before you kind of end up talking about it sometimes. And that, that's where I was. Like at that moment of time, I didn't want to talk about it because I didn't want to make it as real as it was, even though it was real. It's some weird mental state of mind type of thing, but Back in January, me and my fiance at the time actually decided to separate, guys. Um, I think a lot of you already kind of noticed it because I stopped wearing the ring forever ago. I think a lot of you are also very considerate in the fact that in the comments you didn't constantly point it out, but I do see a lot of people asking where is my fiance or saying that I do have a boyfriend or someone in my life. You guys, I don't. I haven't in a while. Um, and it was totally mutual on both our parts. You know, sometimes you're with someone for so long. I mean, it was seven years that I was with him. Um, and I wish him all the best every day of my life. I don't want anything bad to happen to him. He was my best friend. He was my lover. He was my family. And he still is family, you know. But people just change over time. And even though it's sad... Um, Sometimes things are for the best, you know, and you just have to kind of move forward from it. Even even though change is totally terrifying. Like, back then, it was absolutely terrifying, guys. Um, it was so rough to, I don't know, to just be on my own again. You, you When you're in a relationship for so long, you kind of... It's, it's a team. It's both of you. It's not just one of you. Like, you think of everything in twos, almost. I don't know how to explain it, but um, to kind of go back to being more independent was scary at first, and now it is invigorating. Invigorating? Invigorating. Yes. I love it. I fucking love it. To not have to answer to anyone but myself feels amazing. <laughs> like I said, I wish him all the best for his future even though we've parted ways, um, and he wishes me all the best for my future. He still encourages me to, you know, take steps forward as well. Um, and yeah, I mean, that that's just kind of like an end of a chapter in my life, and now it's, it's time to move forward. And this personal vacation was much fucking needed after going through a hell of a winter, guys. It was a hell of a winter. <laughs> But yeah, I'm basically just gonna go on a relaxing little adventure and bring you guys along with me. Um, I'll be with one of my friends, which is always fun. What else was I gonna say? Oh, okay, so during that time, obviously I'll do vlogs. When I come back, I'm gonna try to jump right back into Spider-Man. You guys do wanna see the DLC, so I'm hoping I can do that. Some of you said that they were actually pretty quick because by the end of this month, we have some games start to roll out and they're gonna go back to back and they're going to be more long standing on the channel. And I don't want to like immediately just be like, oh, I'm gonna play this, I'm gonna play that, you know, like I wanna wait. Some of them will be surprises for you. Some of you have probably already heard that I've been excited to play whatever else, but I don't wanna just like 
blow it all because sometimes I think it's fun to just pop in with a game and you guys be like super excited for it. So definitely look forward to some fun stuff then as well as obviously, you know, Man of Madon is going to come out by, I think it's August 30th. Yes, it's August 30th. And I'll be playing that with Tofu. So I am so excited to play that game with her. It's going to be so much fun. Like I won't even be able to hear her talk. Uh, we won't hear her at all. We're just going to see some of her actions affect our actions and, and vice versa. And it's going to be fucking, it's going to be so much fun, guys. So yes, when I get back, I'm hoping to be able to play those DLCs. Um, and was there anything else that I wanted to say? We just have, we have a busy fall, guys. We have a really, really, really busy fall. Oh, yeah. Basically, what I'm trying to do is not overwhelm myself because some of you, it's it's interesting. Some of you don't like when I play too many games at one time because you feel like it takes away from the experience or it takes me too long to get so-and-so up. Um, but then some of you don't like when it's a singular game that I'm playing on the channel because it's not enough diversity. So I kind of have to find like this balance in between, um, which has been kind of hard for me to figure out what to do. And I just, did you just see that? I just, miss arm rest air, awkward. But yeah, now I just feel like talking. This is, this is when streaming would be nice because I just feel like talking to you guys. Oh, that's another thing. So I bought a cam link. I bought like all this shit to help do streams and then, um, all of it malfunctioned. I've been trying, I've been messing around. Like I did a patron stream because it's easier for me to get into the swing of things to stream to patrons. They just are a little bit more kind when I have a bunch of fuck ups. But yeah, my my camera basically needs upgraded. I, I need to sort all of that stuff out and I'm not going to be streaming as often as you would think, of course, when I get it all fixed. At this rate, it's taking me forever. I understand that, but this past month has been go, 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 nonstop. Um, hopefully, I will be able to sort all of that shit out because, yeah, every time I tried to do anything, it was just technology. Sometimes it just does not work. I might be able to get a friend to actually help me do that. So there is that fun goodie. I'm gonna try to stream every once in a while. Like I said, it's not gonna be super often. Um, just cause I'm not, I, I don't know, like, I'm a very shy person and I get really, um, easily embarrassed sometimes. So obviously it would be a slow build up to get into streaming, being able to talk to you guys a little bit more fluidly as well as I don't have a second monitor, so I have to buy another monitor and that's another huge purchase for me. It's going to take me a minute. What else am I going to say? I don't know. Oh, you guys are always commenting on my mug. If you guys didn't see it in the Spider-Man gameplay, look at this fucking mug and tell me this is not, this is not the best shit you ever seen. It's got Mickey Mouse on it. Like, <laughs> I think it literally is the size of my face. You guys are always saying that my mugs are huge, but look at this cup as well. This is a big ass cup, guys. Um, Now I'm just rambling. Now I'm just rambling. I know exactly what's gonna happen too. I'm gonna turn off the camera. I'm gonna end this and wrap it up. And then I'm totally gonna forget something and realize, oh fuck, I should have talked about that with them. I don't, I don't feel like there's anything more aside from, you know, really I need to say thank you to you guys for being so patient with me and giving me this opportunity in general. A lot of times, more often than not lately, actually, I get wrapped up in this mindset of, well, th this comparison mindset, you know, like, you know, my stuff isn't as good as this channel or my stuff isn't as good as that channel or maybe I'm not doing this well or blah, 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 blah. And you guys have stood by me through and through no matter what. And like a lot of times behind the scenes, you don't see that perspective like that I do go through my own stressors and um, self-doubt and feeling defeated and stuff like that. But you guys constantly encourage me to keep taking steps forward, constantly remind me that what I'm doing is helping people, um, that I can bring a smile to your guys' face at the end of the day. And that is genuinely what matters the most to me, other than all of the lights and the cameras and the expensive equipment and, um, Obviously, the games are pretty fucking cool, but just being able to 
I don't know, just make a difference in someone else's day is first and foremost, like that, that's priority to me. Um, so I just want to say thank you. 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 Thank you for giving me this opportunity. Thank you guys for sticking by me through all of this. And even when I was going through that low point, you guys didn't know it, but as much as you say that I pull you through them, you guys pull me through them as well. I mean, being in that position when I was really sad and kind of going through all those changes, being able to do this and hang out with you guys and talk to you guys on Discord or in Twitter or, or wherever else in the comments, um, having a career to, you know, take my mind and, and concentrate on that during a low point, it helped me so, so much. And I don't know, I just want to make sure you guys understand that as much as I help you, you help me. Um, I love you guys. I am so fucking grateful for this channel and for everything that you have given me. Y'all have given me the opportunity to stand on my own two feet independently. And that, that means a lot. Don't cry. <laughs> Don't cry. Can't cry. Let me relax a little bit. But it, it really, it really does mean a lot to me. A lot, a lot, a lot. So yes, you guys keep being amazing, loving, and empathetic human beings, encouraging each other, connecting with each other, just, just knowing that you guys take something positive from the channel as a whole means a shit ton to me. I just want you guys to know that I'm eternally grateful for that, for everything that you have done and given me this opportunity to do something I'm extremely passionate about and love doing, so thank you. All right, sob story done, guys. <laughs> it's always, uh, yeah, when I start thinking about that, I get so, so emotional. Like, the messages you guys send me is so motivating. Oof, but if I go missing for a couple days, if I don't have a vlog up, just know that I'm relaxing a little bit. I will be back ASAP, I promise you, and I will get back on to Spider-Man. Don't worry, I'll get back to Days Gone as well. I'm just super into Spider-Man right now, like one track mind. But yeah, make sure to check out the links in the description. If you'd like to join Discord, that link is down below. It's basically a server you guys can come and meet each other, talk amongst each other. There's a bunch of different categories if you guys wanna just chill or talk about something more specific. I do try to jump on there at least once a day. It's been a little bit harder for me lately to be as um, a part of the community just because I've been busy trying to film for everything and and pre-film and yeah, for this vacation, it, I haven't been around Discord as often, but I do stop in at least once a day. So if you wanna join that, go ahead. There is a Patreon link if you want to become a patron. And yeah, leave a like if you enjoyed and thanks for watching guys.